Hey, what's up? I don't know if you just got done listening to the first video, watching the first video, listening, watching, I don't know. I'm used to saying listening now from the podcast. Um, but this is my announcement for the second program I'm offering for the end of uh, 2014. Um, the first was Tattoo Mentor, Session 2 of 2014. If you're interested in that, go back and to wherever you found this and look for that one and watch that one. But where you are now is you are at my brand new program, the first program of its kind, a step-by-step -step guide to getting a professional tattoo apprenticeship. What? Yeah. Uh, I'm not offering you an apprenticeship. If you think I'm offering you an apprenticeship, uh, hit stop and watch something else. Um, no. What I am offering you, though, is a chance, in all seriousness, to improve the possibility of you getting an apprenticeship in the shop you want to with the artist that you really really would like to I'm gonna increase those chances exponentially how can you do that well I'll tell you I'm talking to myself I know I am now, I'm gonna tell you how I can do that you know how I could do that because the most asked question uh, in my career 21 years of tattooing is how do I get an apprenticeship um, and then you could also put in there people coming in and asking for apprenticeships. So I have a lot of experience with this topic. And what I've found out for the most part is that uh, people of all ages and all artistic skill levels, uh, they want apprenticeships. Uh, and that's a good thing because at least that means that group of people knows the right path. The right path to learning how to tattoo is a professional apprenticeship. It's not YouTube videos. Um, you can't learn from a book. Uh, you know, uh, I really don't, I don't back the people who are putting up how to tattoo things on YouTube and, you know, you know, rah, rah, championing this cause, you know, oh, well, the professionals just don't want us to, you know, take their business. Yeah, well, you, you ain't taking my business. I'll tell you that right now. Uh, and you're not going to take the business of anybody that I've mentored and helped in the past or in the future uh, because they're better than that. Um, so what I am offering you guys, like I said, is the opportunity to get doors open for you a lot more easily uh, than they would be now. When you go in cold to a tattoo studio, um, it's my experience that you guys are coming in, you guys, girls, kids, adults... You have no idea what's going on. You could have just come from uh, Pratt or FIT or School of Visual Arts. You know, you have a big portfolio of your stuff and, you know, just sketches and drawings falling out all over the place. And you're a great artist. But you don't know thing one about what you're supposed to do when you walk into a tattoo shop. You don't know how to walk into a good tattoo shop. I mean, you could walk into a crappy shop and get an apprenticeship without all that stuff. We're talking about getting into the right shop with the right people a professional shop where you're going to get a great learning experience. You're going to be uh, mentored by an excellent artist, uh, taught, and you're going to wind up with a decent career uh, in tattooing. This is not going to come necessarily from your local shop. It might. Maybe you have a great local shop. But yeah, as you've, you've known or heard or, or if you've listened to podcasts or any other stuff that I put out there, really only 10% of the industry is... Uh, kicking ass, doing the right thing, good business practices, good disease control, good art, um, just, you know, across the board, good ethics. The other 90%, not so much. A lot of people who are in it who maybe shouldn't be in it, in it for the wrong reasons, money, not artists, um, you know, just in it. This is another business, you know, maybe they own 10 businesses and one of them's a tattoo shop. Uh, this is not what you want to be. This is not how you're going to learn. That's the shop you're going to walk in. They're going to just hand you a machine and tell you to start tattooing. Now, maybe some of you light up when you hear that. Um, you shouldn't. I mean, it sounds like an amazing opportunity, but really, you're going to have to unlearn everything you learn wrong. And uh, I know that for a fact. I know a little of it from experience, uh, and uh, I know a lot of it from having to teach people uh, and reteach people some of which were tattooing over five years. Uh, so again, I'm not gonna teach you anything about how to tattoo in this. So if you wanna learn how to tattoo or you think you're gonna learn anything about technically how to tattoo, uh, 
hit stop wherever stop is because this is not what I'm offering you. What I am offering you is a step-by-step -step guide to putting your best foot forward, to getting into a tattoo shop, to making the best impression you could possibly make, an impression that is way more likely to get you a tattoo apprenticeship than you could possibly ever get going in cold. I'm going to give you the tips to show your best foot to the person you're interviewing with. I'm going to show you what I want to see when a young person, old person, male, female, doesn't matter. When someone comes into my shop, I'm going to teach you who the dream person is who walks through the door in a good tattoo studio. The ones we're waiting for. The ones where, like, oh my God. When you know, we won't say it when you're there. When you walk out, that's a big tattoo staple. We talk about you after you leave. But uh, no, seriously, I'm going to give you guys a lot of, uh, you know, inside information about what you need to do to prepare. And you know what? Maybe in preparing for how to get your apprenticeship, you're going to really learn more about tattooing and the culture and do I really want to do this? Um, or, wow, I love this even more now that I know more about it. Or, ooh, maybe I shouldn't have gone in with a crack pipe in my coat pocket. These are just some of the tips <laughs> that I will share with you in the program. So anyway, uh, it starts October 14th. Send me an email, tattoosbykeith at mac.com. That's T-A-T-T-O-O-S-B-Y-K-E-I-T-H at mac.com. I think I'm going to write a little jingle for that. Um, but get that out to me, and I will send you the long-form information for the course. It's six weeks. Um, as I may or may not have said, it's similar in, in respect to the Tattoo Mentor Program because it's handled the same way. You're going to watch online course uh, videos once a week. You're going to be required to submit uh, assignments. I will then, um, you know, paint over and voice over your assignments on video. Uh, they'll be uploaded. You'll be able to view yours as well as your um, fellow participants. So, like I said in the last video on Tattoo Mentor, this means if my videos are an hour, an hour and a half long, let's say an hour just for the sake of math, and your six, that's a potential seven hours of video a week for six weeks. That's a ton of content. No matter how you slice it, that is a ton of content. Uh, and we will also have at the close, uh, there's two of these for Tattoo Mentor, but since this is a shorter, um, this is a shorter program, uh, there's really only need for one. At the end of this, we will have either a Skype or a Google Hangout, um, with everyone and myself where we will do at least an hour uh you know we'll try to keep it in the neighborhood of an hour but i want everybody to get equal time uh of a one-on-one -on -one, uh, not a one-on-one -on -one, a group meeting where everyone everyone will have the opportunity to an ask any questions uh address any of the criticisms they received address any of the information that i gave to you guys ask questions that weren't answered in the course if that's the case uh but you will have that final uh, session where we will be there face you know face to face computer to computer however you want to put it but uh, you're gonna have that opportunity to uh, for you guys to all interact with me directly at the close of the session so that you don't leave with any unanswered questions because I don't want that I want you guys to have your questions uh, all answered if you are serious about getting an apprenticeship if you're serious about getting an apprenticeship I want to help you if you want to tattoo out of your house or learn from YouTube or, you know, learn by downloading bit torrents of, you know, tattoo DVDs that people have worked real hard on, not even speaking for myself, um, then I don't want to help you. Do it on your own. Whatever. You know? That's right. I'm talking to you. Tattoo your cousin with your elbow on a box of Velveeta shells and cheese on the kitchen table. We see those pictures. With no clipcord sleeve and blood and... Don't be a dummy. Don't be a dummy. That's my appeal to the kids out there. Don't be dummies. But I, I'm going to help you guys. So thanks very much. Uh, hopefully I'll get your email and you guys will send uh, 
send that to tattoos by Keith at Mac.com. I will send you the information for this. If you were interested in the tattoo mentor session two, go back where you found this and uh, watch that video or hey here you are same email address you're gonna send it to tattoos by Keith at Mac.com uh, but just in your subject line you're gonna write tattoo mentor session two and those of you who are looking for the how to get an apprenticeship program you're going to write um, apprenticeship uh, apprenticeship guide or something as long as the word is apprenticeship is in there I'll uh, I'll know what to send you so anyway I really care about you guys who are taking it serious, who really want to do this the right way, and that's awesome. Don't start without help. Don't get equipment and tattoo out of your house. Don't, 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 don't. No matter how tempting it is, wait until you get in the hands of a qualified operator who can keep you safe and keep your family and friends safe. Uh, and, and, you know, we want good people in the industry we want good people in the business you know we're just trying to keep the bums out so don't be a bum do it the right way tattooing is not a hobby it is not a hobby get a paint by numbers buy some puzzles don't tattoo and you could be a tremendously talented artist it's not I know it's hard it's hard it's hard criticism to take it's a bitter pill to swallow Tattooing is for people who want to tattoo all day, you know, every day. It's There's a lot more to it than just the art. So hopefully I can help you guys uh, with the steps to get an apprenticeship and hopefully in the process help you make an educated decision on whether or not you even want to pursue tattooing. Uh, I'm going to be straight with you. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, and I want to produce only good fruit with these programs. So... Thank you so much for listening to me rant about this. Uh, don't forget the podcast, TattooMentor.com. Listen to some funny podcasts with some great tattoo artists. Uh, and uh, that's an inspiration as well. You'll hear some crazy stories about some people who had to do some, uh, you know, serious things, serious sacrifices to be part of, uh, part of tattooing. So anyway, I hope I get your emails uh, and I'll talk to you guys real soon. Thanks.